Hi, this is Brother Sean with eLearning Brothers. And to, in this tutorial, I'd like to just show you how to modify the styles, the, the color, the look and the feel of our Adobe Captivate layout templates. And so right now I've got one of our templates opened up and this is Adobe Captivate 6. And the cool thing about Adobe Captivate 6 is they came out with something called the Object Style Manager. There's styles that are attached to every one of the objects within our master slide. All these different layouts, all these objects on here have a style um, attached to them. If you're familiar with CSS um, in web design, um, it's a very similar technology that Captivate built into this and that we've leveraged building our templates. So let me just show you how easy it is to modify the colors and the look and feel of all of our layouts um, within our template with just really just a few minor steps. So let's say we want to change this banner from yellow to a green color. First thing I need to do is select the banner. Make sure you don't just select the text, you want to select the banner behind the text. Then you go over to your properties panel, and then you can just come over here and you can pick a different gradient color or a different fill color. So I'm going to pick a green color like that, and maybe I want to change the stroke also and add a stroke to it. Let's do kind of a, let's do a darker green and just so we can see it for our demonstration, I'm going to put about a four pixel stroke. And once I get it how I like it, what I can do is just click my Save Changes to Existing Style button right over here. And what it's going to do is it's going to modify or update my banner style with this new green color that I've done. Now if you look at all the master slides, that green color has taken effect for all my banner elements. Now it doesn't matter which master slide I modify, as long as I click that Save Existing Style button, it's going to apply to everything. You know, if I'm modifying the banner, there's also, if you can see it, there's a little corner effect that helps this banner look like it, it kind of pops out. You can select that, you know, maybe turn that to a really dark green also, so it looks like it's popping out. Click Save, and then that'll change all those little corner effects now to that dark green. If you want to change, you know, your box color, exact same thing. Pick a different style, different color, and then you can just save over your existing style. Give Captivate just a minute to kind of catch up here, but you'll notice as it catches up that all those boxes are going to be changed to that blue color now. So very simple to update the styles um, for our layout templates. That's what makes these templates really cool is that it's very easy to brand and customize the look and feel of them. If you want to change the pink background color, you just go over to your master slide, the very first one, which is the largest one over here, and anything you do on this slide, it's going to show for all the other slides. So if you change the color to a purple, it's going to show purple for everything, or, or this grayish blue color. If you want to add like a logo to it, you know, you can go out and import, um, let me do insert image. You can go out and find a logo if you have one out there, insert that in, and wherever you insert it, you'll notice that it's going to show for all the other slide layouts. Um, so very easy to brand, customize these templates. As you modify the styles that are already um, built and attached to all the elements, you see how simple it is to build a very customized, branded um, e-learning course using these layout templates. I hope this has been helpful to you. Thank you.